There is no greater joy or fulfillment than I feel than being here at home speaking to high school girl athletes. Uh, so thank you for the honor of allowing me to be up here today. It is truly my favorite group of people. I do think it's really important for all the girls in this room that to know where you're going, you have to know where we've been. I just want to share that and say how important that is. And none of us are here today just because of our, our own accolades, right? It, it takes a village. It's cool to be a girl and a woman in sports. They are actually the superheroes in sports. So instead of having to just fight and scrap and everything to get that equal access, now they're the ones that are on top of the world. As you know, participating in athletics is about so much more than winning and losing. I encourage you to take what you have learned from sports and use it to pay it forward, to help others and to mentor other young women just like you as they're growing into their roles. Each one of you is a true role model and you have so much to offer in this world. Our job is to leave that door just a little bit wider for those that come behind us. You're here not just because of your accomplishments in sports, but because of your accomplishments in the classroom, in the community, and with your relationships. Your legacy will not end in high school. And in fact, that's when it's just beginning. No longer are we scrapping. Are we trying to get anything, trying to get the equal access? Instead, we're setting the bar. And that is what we're celebrating here. All of each of every, every one of you setting the bar to be the best in your field. And each and every one of you is the best here today. Talk about the 2%, 2% just in the district. You guys are the top 1%.